I love my new drawers. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this one. Hello everyone, happy Saturday. So it's been a crazy, crazy week already so far, you guys. Oh my gosh. Just a quick little update. Our little Ollie man, he's not doing great. Basically on Saturday night when we got home, I noticed he was limping and I was really worried if that he hurt himself, like just like running to the door and he just wasn't himself. Like it was on Sunday morning and like we were just like, Ross is like, you need to take him to the vet. He just was not himself. I took him to the vet, we ran blood work, everything. We got him on some medicine because we thought it was his knee and stuff like that. But then his blood work is showing something else. It's showing that there's like ketones in his urine and we were like, well, he hasn't been eating. And so we didn't know if his body's in ketosis. So we don't know if there's something going on with his kidneys and his gallbladder. Would they think that he might've gotten some type of bacteria from maybe like, like, you know, going in the backyard and all this rainfall that we've been having. They said like if wildlife goes and pees or anything near there and he drinks the water and it's contaminated water, he can get it and it's just not good. So it could be like called what was it called? Lipto, liptocirrhosis is what they think he might have. So we're going to test his blood for that. I'm taking him back in because we're going to get him some fluids. They're going to put um, syringe feed him and then also give him medicine because they're like, he has to eat something to keep this medicine down. And then to give him also a like an like anti-nausea like uh, shot and everything. I'm just like praying for him, praying. Like right now that I'm filming this, this is on Tuesday. So I literally have to film this really quickly because I have to leave here fast. Should we go take him to the vet? But yeah, it's just been a lot. Like I just need, I just need life to just be easy and I just want him to be okay. And it's just, yeah. So please say some prayers for Ollie man, my little guy. I feel, oh, I just like want to make sure he's okay. So I'll be updating everyone on Instagram throughout this week, which you guys have probably have already seen, but like, let's hopefully that it is this leptocirrhosis or whatever it's called and the medicine will treat it. That's like the nice thing about it. They said they go, we don't really want him to have it, but if he does, it'd be kind of good because it's treatable. So um, we're gonna see. We're gonna also start him on like a bacteria medicine just to fight any infection that he may have. So doxycycline just in case. And then we'll just go from there. So I just thought I would do this quick little update for you guys. Um, it's a really small week because it's Tuesday. I picked up packages yesterday. So I'm thinking next week is gonna be bigger because it's a longer like wait of getting packages. I'm sorry, it's a small week, but let's go ahead and get into what is new this week. All right, so the first package is from M Cosmetics and they were so sweet. They reached out to me and they wanted to send me some product, which I am so excited about. I love Michelle. I cannot wait to try out more from them because I think I've only ever used their eyeliner, which is amazing, their liquid liner, so good. So we've got more products, so. Uh, right here, we have the Heaven's Glow Radiant Veil Blush and Magic Hour. It looks like this. This is the packaging. It's always so sleek and pretty. I love it. And then, oh, look at that. It's like a baked blush. Oh, that is really, really pretty. Oh, this is really pretty. So you guys can see it. It's a very nice, just like neutral, like everyday peachy blush which I've actually been going for right now. I've been using more of a peach and I've been thinking it's like looks really pretty cause it's just like natural and it's just there. I love it. We also have another thing right here. This is the, ooh, Divine Skies eyeshadow palette. So let's check this one out. This is the packaging. So cool, it's their logo. And then, oh, I love my neutrals. Oh my God, I'm so excited for this one. Cause this is like everything that I would put on my eyes, which is great. I'm going to apply some really quickly right now. I'm gonna do this like matte brown one into my crease. Cause I don't have any eyeshadow on right now. Just gonna pop that into the crease like so. And then I'm gonna take a fluffy blending brush. I'm just gonna blend this out. And then on the lid, I'm gonna go in with this kind of like shimmer champagne shade right here, which is really pretty. And I'm just going to pack this nice and lightly on the lid right here. Oh, that's really pretty. Oh, I just love how soft looking that is. Oh, this is a good eyeshadow palette. 
And then for nighttime, I would go in with this like deeper brown into the crease, but since it's daytime, I'm gonna keep it just more, just like softer and neutral. So I'm just gonna blend that out and then that will be my eye look. So I like this, this is pretty. I love my neutrals. So that is really, really pretty right there. I love that. Now let's go into these guys right here. So we've got this So Soft Multi Face Play. This is Bronze and Sculpt in Terra. Oh, I am so excited for this. Oh my God, you guys know how much I love like cream bronzers. And then we have this, let's go to this one right here. This is So Soft Blush and this is in Baby. This is also another really, really pretty shade. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to use these. We will film with these tomorrow, you guys. Oh, look at that pink. Oh, that is gorgeous. And it blends out so nicely. I love that. Then we have the Everglass Lip Dew in Lullaby. Ooh, this is pretty. It's a nice nude. And it's actually like really pigmented too. Look at that. Ooh, that one's gonna be a fun one. I love my nudes, so that is great. So I believe that this is the, oh, this is the Microfluff Sculpting Brow Cream in Soft Blonde. Oh my God, I'm excited for this. Oh, I love how, look how fine this one is. Ooh, we're gonna use this. Oh, I can't wait. Definitely going to do a, like a TikTok, get ready with me with these. We have another brow cream and this one is in Universal Taupe that we'll try out as well. And then we go into these guys. Oh, these are pretty. These are their soft spoken lip creams. So we have Petal and Whisper. So let me show you Whisper. This is the packaging, gorgeous. Ooh. Oh, these are nice. These are nice and light. They're moussey too, so they're gonna be comfortable. So that one right there is Whisper. And then we have Petal, which looks really pretty too. So here is Petal. I love the packaging with that ombre and how you can see the shade of the lipstick in there. I think that's really cool. And then, oh, oh yeah, this one's really pretty. I like this one. This one's like, so you've got Whisper, which is a little bit more of a peachy shade. And then you have Petal, which is a little bit, has more like rose tones in it. And then we've got a brush right here, which is, out, 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 come on. It's a duo fiber brush right here to use with the products. Love that. And then we have the Soft Blur Velvet Lip Liner. Oh, love lip liners and I'm running low on them right now. So, oh my God, this is a great nude. And these are mechanical, so you just, twist them up and you don't have to sharpen them, which is great, I love that. It's a great nude. And then we've got a bunny, which this one looks a little bit more of a rose shade or pinky. Oh yeah, this is pretty. This is like definitely, it's like your lip color but better right there. So there is a bunny. And then we've got, oh, we have another, oh, we have a brow pencil and this is in light taupe. Oh, I've been on the hunt for a new one right now, you guys. So we've got a brow pencil here and it's got the spoolie on the other side too, which I love. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to do the brow gel and then like fill in and see if I can go for a more natural look for a brow. I'm gonna try that out. And then we have the lip cushion, which is a tinted lip luminizer. And this is in the shade Venetian Rose. Oh, it's one of these guys. Is it a twisty? Yeah, it's a twisty. Oh my God, this is like really moisturizing too. It's like a balm. It reminds me of the balms. Um, like a lot of different pr um, brands have this. Like one of the first brands that I saw with one of these products was like the Coda Lee ones, which are really, really good. And then Tarte has some too now, which is great. And then we've got the Illustrative Eyeliner. This is the brush tip. This is the eyeliner that I was talking to you guys about. This is like the one product, I remember when they launched, like this was the one product I used so much. It was so freaking good. So I'm excited to have another one because I love doing a winged when I go out at night. 
so that is awesome so thank you so much m cosmetics you guys are the best i really appreciate it and i cannot wait to do a get ready with me with these products i'm so stoked so make sure you're following me on instagram at madison miller and then also on tiktok at underscore life and maddie underscore all right so next up is from nature nate okay i heard them say this and i knew i was butchering it but i don't remember how they pronounce it but I say natrium, it's naturium, I think maybe. I don't know, I'm totally butchering it. But anyways, I've been super excited about this guy because I saw this on Instagram the other day and this is the Softener Creamy Clay Body Wash. Clay to cream formula that clarifies and softens skin and it's fragrance free. We actually just ran out of our other body wash from Naturium, Natrium, whatever the name is. So I'm super stoked to add this into the shower and try this one out. I love like the foamy ones and stuff. Ah, just like these ones are best. And then also having that pump in there is so easy to get on my loofah and stuff. So I'm so Super stoked about that. So thank you so much for sending that one over. Okay, so next up is a package from Lottie London and this is the Kim Kim Nails right here. So it's a collaboration and these right here, look at how cute this is. I love this. Oh, so pretty. Okay, so we have Lottie London is back again to hook you up with their second nail collab with Hollywood's ultimate nail technician, Kim Churong, aka Kim Kim Nails. So with a celeb roster featuring Kim and Kourtney Kardashian, Dua Lupa, Katy Perry, and Kerry Washington, to name a few, Kim Churong collabs with Lottie London to help you get a Hollywood celeb celeb level Manny from home slay your Manny goals so we've got different ones here which are super cool I love oh my god if I didn't have nails I would put this one on right now especially with my pink jacket I think that is awesome super fun and then we've got these drip nails right here which totally remind me of like Kylie Cosmetics you know with the drip these ones are gorgeous they remind me of like almost like cherry blossoms those are really, really pretty too. Honestly, I need to just take a picture of like some of these nails and like take them in there and see if they can like do the nail art to them because I love the nail art. It's so pretty and this is so cool. I love that. So thank you, Lottie Linden. Okay, so next up is really, really exciting. We've got a ColourPop collection, you guys. So we've got definitely some makeup. So at least we've got like a really good... A good Saturday, you guys, even though we don't have many, but it's a good one. So we've got the Bloom On Collection here. We've got the Heavy Petal Palette here, which I love ColourPop's palettes. I think they are amazing. This is what the packaging looks like, super pretty. And then, oh, this is gorgeous. I love these, so pretty. You can do so many different looks. Like you can definitely go into the neutrals and you've also got your like your plums here and your pinks, which I think is really pretty. It's just really soft and like kind of romantic. And then this Thrive shade, look at this. Oh my God, that is gorgeous right there. That is really, really pretty. And then we have this shimmer one. Oh, I love shades like this on my lid. Peony. Peony is a really pretty pink too. Like honestly, you could take some of these shimmers and then like put peony first on and then take your finger and then just dab it over peony just to kind of transform it. I think that would be really, really fun. We also have the face milk here in rose. And this is basically after cleansing, toning and serum, apply two to three drops into palms, warm between hands and you can use it in the morning and night. So this is just a serum right here. It actually be probably really nice like before you put your makeup on and then we have some luxe lipsticks here you guys so we have floor you i love color pops lipsticks so floor you is a really pretty just like petal pink right there that one is gorgeous as totally my type of like nudie pink we have bloom time bloom time is a little bit more of a deeper rose also really pretty tulip season tulip season is more of a deeper like a deeper magenta and then we have pink bouquet and pink bouquet is like a deeper like, oh it's like kind of like a i would say this one's more of a rose i would say this one is like a deeper like apricot because of how peachy it is you can see this one's more like a mauve and stuff so really pretty shades i like those all very wearable and then 
let's swatch some of their cheek dews here. So they have four cheek dews and these are their serum blushes. So we have Petal Up. So this is what they look like. I'm gonna swatch a couple of these. Let's open them up. We've got Dream Garden. Oh, look at that pink. I love that pink. We have Spring Flush, which is more of an orangey one. And then last but not least, we have Flower Delivery. This is perfect for spring. So we've got more of a neutral here. The one that I'm like really going for is the pink here. So let's try this one out. So these swatch, oh, they're just really pretty. You rub them in. And so like, honestly, like you could probably even like totally go for the shade and it's just gonna sheer out, which is perfect. So it's just like a nice light tint, which is gonna be great for the spring and the summertime. Like honestly, you could do this without makeup and like maybe use some concealer, no foundation, and just put some of this on your cheeks just to bring that flush into your cheeks. I think that would be really, really pretty. And it gives you even just like a really pretty glow. Like look at that glow to it. That's gorgeous. So. Thank you so much ColourPop for this collection. Super excited about it. Can't wait to use it. Okay, so next up I have a package from Saturday Skin. It says pep up your hair with peptides. So this is a strengthening peptide treatment. Super exciting to see them do hair now stuff, you guys. This is cool. So it says pep up your hair with a new scalp and hair strengthening peptide treatment. This treatment is light, fast absorbing with a cool refreshing sensation to add a buzz to your scalp and hair. So it's got 15 peptides, hops, extract, and caffeine. So basically how you use this is it says after shampooing hair and scalp, towel dry areas, shake bottle before application, and apply a few drops as needed once daily, ideally in the evening. Massage into scalp thoroughly, leave this on treatment, do not wash off after application. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the dropper, you're gonna put it in. And then like also they sent over a scalp exfoliator, which actually would be really good for me gotta use this guy oh it even just feels good putting it in there because it's really hard to get your scalp with your hair extensions so definitely need to use this so thank you so much Saturday Skin for sending this over just to show you guys the packaging of it right here you leave it in you don't wash it out so I will definitely give this a go and I will keep you guys updated on it all right so I got a box here I don't know who it's from it's Dermalogica, sweet. I haven't got anything from Dermalogica in a while, so I'm super stoked about this. Um, I'm like all sitting comfy over here. So breathe new life into aging. So this is the Phyto Nature Oxygen Cream. Oh, so it's a liquid moisturizer that reawakens youth by firming, lifting, and revitalizing skin with a premium oxygen optimizing Phyto Actives. So how it works is phytoactives improve skin's oxygen absorption and optimization process, restoring vitality to the skin. And the astragalus and antioxidant-rich rose of winter smooth, soothe, and tighten aging skin. The squalane and the loofah root visibly firm skin and minimize the look of lines and wrinkles. So you apply it on clean, dry skin and light upward strokes use morning and night. So basically it's going to give you firmer, soft, smoother, brighter, and more energized skin. I am all about that. I could use that. And this is like the really cute bag that it came in. Oh my God, I'm gonna use this for travel. I'm gonna use it for my skincare bag. So nice. Oh, I love that. So this is the product right here. This is what it looks like. Cannot wait to try this out. Oh my God, I love Dermalogica. Ooh, it's a really nice like glass bottle here. Like you can hear. Ooh. Oh! Hang on. I was like, it's not like that. It can't be it. Let's put some on the back of my head. So here's the consistency of it feels really good and it just oh my god look at my skin oh my god I can't, and it it smells like a spa you know how you walk in and you're in your robe and you're waiting to get a massage and they have like those like essential oils going that's what it smells like and just look at the glow it gave my skin on my hand 
Oh, I cannot wait to try this out on my face. Okay, so last but not least, you guys, we have Kristen's collaboration that she did with Sigma Beauty. I am so excited. Congrats, Kristen. I cannot wait. I was watching her videos. I watched like her um, Instagram stories, her Instagram, and then also the YouTube video where she tested them out and used them. So I'm super stoked because she said that she's been working on this for a long time and she made like all new brushes, which is awesome. She put a lot of effort into it. And I think the aesthetic is really pretty like with this ombre packaging right here. Absolutely gorgeous. And then I love it that they sent over product here to use with the brushes too. That was so smart. Cause you know, like you usually get collaborations and it will be like their eyeshadow palette and like the brushes or just the brushes. So I think it's really smart that they send over like, you know, colors and stuff to like products that what you could use with these brushes. So I love that. And, oh, such a good idea. Here is the brush kit right here. Super pretty. I actually need to clean my brushes so bad and this is probably gonna prolong it because I'm probably just gonna use these ones. <laughs> so they come packaged up. So she came out with an angled cheek, an eye and nose contour, a face contour, all over face precision, setting powder, and brighten and bake one right here. So you guys can kind of just get like a quick little overview of it. This is also, oh, this is so nice. Oh, I love the handles. It's like a soft matte. It's like that matte packaging. Oh, it's so pretty. So pretty. So this is what it looks like. This is the setting powder one. This is the face contour. Yes, this is the all over precision face. So you can use this however you would want to. And then um, this is the brighten and bake. Ooh, I love this. I like it how it's nice and flat, it's dense and it's small. So it's easy to get in there and bake with it. Cause I use this one from Sigma right here, which I love is that hers is a little bit smaller. So it's a little bit more precise, but this is the one that I use. It's a skin perfecting brush. I think it's F67, but this is what I use to set my face with because I press it into the skin. So I'm super excited about this one because this one is actually more, it's smaller, so more precise. So I love that. And then we have their angled cheek, which is great for contour or if you want to use it with blush, like whatever you want to use that for. And then we also have a eye and nose contour one right here. So this is great to contour here. And then you could also use it to blend a like bronzer into the crease, which is what I mainly do to be honest. Cause I don't use eyeshadows that well that much anymore. So I love it that she definitely like stuck with face. I feel like we've all kind of drifted away from eyeshadows and we've been doing more like neutral, natural looks. And then they send over their matte bronzer, which I've already been using. I love this bronzer. You guys are gonna see if my February favorites is probably already live. So go check that out because I did, I used all my February like favorite makeup products and I, test, I showed you guys how I apply it and why I like it. So I've been using this bronzer already and it's in that video. It's so good, I love it. So they sent over light, which is the one that I use. We also have the Sigma Sunset, Sunset Kiss Blush. We have their highlight, which I love. This one is in Savannah. And then we have their Spectrum Color Correcting Duo Light to Medium. So I have this, but I have yet to try this out. So I'm glad that kind of reminded me to test this out and I will give it a go. So maybe we'll have another video to film with these products too for TikTok and Instagram, which I'm super excited about. But that is everything in this PR haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was a really good week. We got some great new products to test out. I'm gonna be using them in videos here very soon. And I'm also trying to do more makeup videos as well. It's just trying to get everything like in order again, cause I am, everything is going crazy, but I actually need to get ready to, yeah, I need, it's 120. So I need to head over to the vet's really close to me anyway. So I'm gonna head over to the vet right now Hopefully figure out what's going on with Ollie Man. If you guys want any updates or anything, make sure you just go over to Instagram. It's all there, but I'm praying that he's going to be okay. Anyways, make sure you guys check out my February favorites of me 
getting ready with them. I forgot the name that I'm gonna call that, but make sure you check out that video. It's live on this channel. Also Life of Maddie, I post over there too for more lifestyle content and mom content. And I will see you all in my next video.